here's the deal, you guys. COE is in one month and a couple weeks. Of course, you can always use my affiliate link to buy the tickets, we all know that. And the Spaza17 discount code for merch. But outside of that, Sypho has made a video previously about how to not smell like sex. Now, this video is to me already a timeless classic. It's short, two minutes, straight to the point. That was seven months ago. Now, believe it or not, Sypho just dropped a new video yesterday called The Last Hygiene Video You Will Need. This is for me, for you, and for all of us COE attendees. Let's go. I'm gonna cover every, every hygiene topic. I'm sick of smelling butt-ass niggas that make me wanna fucking hold my breath. At the end of the day, we're all human. Like, it's a, it's a good, it's a good right to breathe air, fresh air. And if I have to hold my breath, like, Okay, but there's no such thing as fresh air at COE. I need you guys' help. I need you to send this video to someone who's f***ing stinky because I know they're not <laughs> doing anything to, like, work on that. I'm gonna cover every... Oh my god. <laughs> alright, alright. I know none of those people, okay? Hygiene Trust topic me. that could, uh, get them smelling like f***ing, uh, India to f***ing a bouquet of flowers. I'm, 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 I'm gonna try my best, you know. Let's get okay. into it. Let's so go. the number one thing I'd advise is to shave your armpit hair and shave your nuts. You know, I have this bootleg manscape. Called but why do? Because guys, it's not gay to, to shave your armpit hair. Yes, it is. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. Happy Pride Month, everybody. I did shave my armpits once and oh, it's so annoying. It stings. It grows back anyway. What's the point? Dude, my, my armpits don't smell. <laughs> yeah, man, I use deodorant. I take showers. Come on, man. If you don't shave your armpit here, you're, you're allowing the bacteria to like grow up in there and it's a lot harder to like Nonsense. clean that shit out when you, when you have a lot of hair. You know, shit like uh, your deodorant crust, that shit stays in there. All the sweat. It's there ain't no crust. It's not girly. Um, if anything, a woman would value a guy that, you know, takes care of their hygiene. So that's a way to take care of your hygiene, shaving your fucking armpits. Step two is to... But what about the balls, though? Two is to get a decent exfoliator when you shower. I use, like, whatever the... This is. Wait, you know, what is that? Exfoliator? Oh, okay. So people actually shower and they don't they don't actually use shit to like clean themselves. Just like soap. And I think that shit's disgusting. Don't don't do that shit. This is getting I mean I, I have a sponge that I use to rub my skin and everything so that the actual soap can do its deed and clean me. You know? I don't really have an exfoliator. Get a good soap, um, Body wash. Soap, I recommend good. soap. Yes, you know, I, I would body agree wash with before, that. But soap is a lot cheaper. It does the same shit. All right, step number three is to get a aluminum deodorant. Aluminum antiperspirant hmm. deodorant. Make sure you get that. Don't get a aluminum free deodorant shit like Native. You know, I heard that's a good brand, but don't get shit like that. What you're actually doing when you use a, a non-aluminum, you're going to sweat a shit ton. And that's how bacteria grows. Hmm. Personally, I use the ones you spray. Obviously, good brands so that it's dry and you don't have your fucking armpits being all wet, dripping. <laughs> you don't want that, obviously. And I've never had issues with stains or anything of that sort. Not sure if it's aluminum free, though. Oh, aluminum. It gives cancer. Oh, no, 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 no. I want to live longer. Oh, I don't give a fuck. I'll take cancer to, to smell better, you know. Um, I see, I see. Well, okay, I don't know about all of that, but I use deodorant, so at this point, I, I definitely fit. Number four, um, clip your fucking fingernails. Um, yes! I be seeing people, like, yes. you know, I used to be a cashier. Yes. Old people licking their fucking fingers, giving you the money. You just see the a bunch of crust on their fucking fingernails. You, you don't want to, like, take anything that they give to you. Yes, guys, do cut your nails. I have very short nails, but even those... If I show them right now, they are a touch dirty <laughs> because obviously I've been streaming for 
however long. So there is some keyboard gunk in there, but generally speaking, yeah, clip your goddamn nails, you animals, and don't eat them, please. Clip your fingernails once a week, okay? Once a week. Once a week? I know it doesn't, like, make you smell, but... If I see you with, like... Okay, once a week is a bit much. Maybe you have insane genetics. I don't think mine grow that fast. <laughs> but, you know, when I see that they're too long, I just I just clip them. Tip number five is to have the right hygiene products. Um, Get a hard bristle toothbrush. Make sure it's not soft. Make sure it's hard. You're not a fucking toddler. Um... <laughs> Wait, what was that cut? Yeah, I also prefer hard to soft. <laughs> I prefer the hard one for my mouth, okay? When it's soft and you put it in your mouth, it doesn't it doesn't feel good in any way. Honestly, it needs to be hard when you go back and forth in your mouth. Like that's basic shit right there. Everybody knows that. So come on. He doesn't even have to say that. It's actually surprising that a lot of people don't know what this is. Yeah, man. You know what? I gotta invest in a tongue scraper. All the shit on your tongue is what's causing the bad breath. It exfoliates your tongue, gets rid I don't have a bad breath, luckily. Thank God for that. Rid of all the bacteria. So we scrape all the bacteria off, you know, you have a, you know, clean smelling mouth. What you have to do is prevent it now. So what you do is get a water flosser. Oh, sh so what Oh, man. Oh, okay. That's a very specific thing, though. I think already if you have a tongue scraper, that's more than good enough. Because, I, I, you know, I also scrape my tongue, but I do it with my toothbrush. Maybe a tongue scraper, I can get behind it. But this thing, I don't know, man. Tip number six, make sure you get like a high-end cologne. Don't get like a $20 cologne that will have you smelling like uh, <laughs> air freshener. That sh I never wear cologne, if I'm being honest with you. I think deodorant is good enough. And if you have proper hygiene... You are going to, you know, smell like a human. <laughs> Maybe you're dirty as fucks too. What do you think? If you come close to me, you will smell the beautiful scent of Italian flowers in the sun. Okay? Just a little bit of wind coming through. I've got that deodorant on. So you come close to me, you can smell I'm clean. And I take showers every day. Especially when I'm at COE. I don't need that cologne, and I definitely don't need an expensive cologne. No, Sifo, this one I'm disagreeing on. Yo, Rafis! Rafis, be honest with me right now. Be honest with me. Did I ever smell it during COE? I know the answer is no, because I take showers every day and I wear deodorant, but the Americans in my chat are telling me you gotta use cologne. Come on, man. Like, that's overkill. Yeah, exactly, man. That's what I'm saying, dude. The European minds connecting that cologne is overkill for everyday use. Tip number seven is to wash your clothes um, once a week. But then, yeah, definitely wash your clothes. Yeah, so those are my hygiene tips. If I if I catch you being stinky, me and my boys will, you know, we'll kidnap you, tie you the fuck up, you know, get some Axe body spray, just like... <laughs> I see, I see. It's not going to be, it's not going to be fun. Send this to someone that is stinky as shit, you know. I don't think the stinky people want to go out their way to, like, see how to not smell bad. So, like, just send it to them. You know, help me a lot. It'll help them, too. It'll help you as well. You know, you don't have to smell stinky f With your help, guys, I can make this world a better place. Just <laughs> send this to a stinky f Very nice, man. Very nice. I will send this to the stinkiest people I know. Got him! Got you, chat. <laughs> I got you. Now go watch this video in your own time before COE, okay? I don't want to catch none of you at COE saying, Hey, what's up, Spaza? Hey, how you doing? And then you smell. I don't want to hear none of that. None of that nonsense. <laughs> no shower challenge at COE, Spaza? Oh, dude. I'm sorry. There's way too many people doing that challenge already. So if we join in, it's going to be a bad time.